Hey everyone, Lou Clark here. And in today's video, I'm going to show you an easy way to change your thoughts from negative to positive, how to change the subconscious thoughts you're having in your head so that you can start to create a life you love. New thoughts mean new mindset equals new results. Before we get started, check out the links in the description below where I've got tons of different freebies, other videos for you to watch and a way you can join me in my discord community. All right, let's get started. You ever feel like you're like, oh my gosh, I'm so fat. Oh, I'm not smart enough. Oh man. If I would have just done that differently, I'm not good enough. That person doesn't like me. It's most of it's inner thoughts that we have. It's not like we say them out loud but I'm going to give you my tool that has helped me to change my mindset. And when I'm having really rough days, I still use this tool to create awareness that I'm speaking negatively to myself about myself and my situations. Are you ready for it? Um, chances are you already have one in your house that you could probably pull out of that junk drawer in the kitchen. It's called an elastic band. This is all you need. You want to change your mindset? Simple. Put your elastic band on your wrist. Okay. Be gentle because this hurts. <laughs> but anytime you have a thought that is not serving you, anytime you have a uh, continuous role playing in your head, maybe you're trying on your clothes and you're like, Oh man, I wish that fit differently. Oh, I wish my, my stomach was smaller right? Or I'm not worth what I'm getting paid or man, that person, whatever it is, if it's not a thought that's serving you for your future, get rid of it. The easiest way to do it is this. That's it. So, oh my gosh, I think my shirt doesn't fit because I've eaten too many muffins. I've just gotten so fat. Oh, man, I wish my hair was longer. I don't know what that noise was, but that was wild. I don't know where that came from. Um, but any mindset, any thoughts that percolate your mind that don't serve you, even when you're thinking about drama or other people or gossip, oh my gosh, can you believe what Susie did yesterday? Oh shoot. Shouldn't do that. The reason being is when you slap the elastic, there is a small element of pain. The pain then sends a Oh no, to the brain. I am not a scientist. I just know this works. Okay. So if you want to look up the scientific method, there's this thing called Google. You can go and check it out. But what I know is when you slap this, there is pain that goes to my head that says, oh, when you think things that aren't appropriate, there is a negative effect. You will subconsciously stop thinking about it. I also use this elastic when we're working on money mindset. When it's like, oh my gosh, I don't have enough money. Oh, I'm so broke. Oh, I'm so stupid. Bing, bing, bing. I remember when I first started using this about 10 years ago and my husband, and I, my husband and I were out at a dinner and I didn't tell him what it was about. Um, but he saw me sitting there like literally going like this. And he's like, what are you doing? I'm like, this is helping me change my, my negative thoughts into positive ones. Because if I hurt myself enough, which you don't really, it doesn't really hurt. Like I could sit here the whole time and do this. But if I do this enough, my brain, my habit of saying I'm fat or I'm stupid, or I don't belong here will change. So don't take it. Don't take this as like, doctor advice or a scientific advice. I'm just telling you the easiest way I changed my mindset around myself to build confidence and to keep the positive thoughts moving so I could move forward positively was using an elastic. And I actually used it more in my money mindset than I did anywhere else. Because if we can't change the thoughts that are going through our heads, we can't change tomorrow. Like Einstein says, doing something over and over expecting a different result is a form of insanity. And the truth is also the same with our mindset and the way we think. If I'm going to keep thinking I'm fat, I'm not going to lose weight because I'm deflated. If I keep thinking I'm broke, I'm not going to get more money in my life because I don't think I deserve it and I don't have a way to get it. So what I want you to do is figure out ways to change your thoughts so you can change your mindset and get the results you want in life. And if it's not an elastic, that's fine. 
But I can tell you, this is what honestly started to change my mindset when I started looking at this, like what, 15 years ago? It's simple and it's annoying and it's a pain, but it works. So whether you use an elastic from your junk drawer or not, I hope you take today to think about the thoughts that are going through your head and how you can change them so you can create a life that you love tomorrow. What you do today creates tomorrow. So if you're not happy with something, it's time to change it. Determination is what's going to get you through. Don't fall back on the lazy habits. Don't fall back on the lazy words. Take the time and the energy that is needed to create the life you want. And if it starts with an elastic band like it did for me, I'm here to support you. And if it's not an elastic band, guess what? I'm still here to support you. So until next time, it's Lou Clark saying, Oh, that felt good. Change your thoughts to change your mindset so you can change your results and live the life you want to live the life you love. We'll see you next time.